Knock knock. Who is that? We want to come and carry Anita for rehearsal. Knock knock. Who is that? Anita and me want to go and practice. Knock knock. They are. My mother said no. This cannot happen. <laughs> this is not why I said that to come and do. They know me now. If you know, you know. Like I'm giving you the bassy level world record standard. So you don't see we are going to. What am I going to? I want to dress. Mm. And then on some other days, I dress to kill you. Period. I dress to smash. <laughs> They heard I was good, they wanna see if it's true. They know you're the one. Hello, welcome to Life and Scripture, Amazing Annie. The channel where it's all good vibes and no negativity, please. You know that. Okay, so today is a very beautiful day. The weather is lovely. Spring is springing. Goodness, I love it here. I love it here, man. It's a public holiday today in Canada. Mm, it's called Victoria's Day. Eh eh. Do I see what Victoria's Day is? Can Google? I don't know. I Google and it was complicated. It was giving me some legislature structure or something. I don't know. I want to enjoy myself today. I don't want to think. If I'm kind enough, I can just put the definition in the corner for you guys. But that's it. Meanwhile. It's Victoria's Day today, and my family is out here with some lovely people, our family members and friends. And so I'm thinking it would be a good day to also do a Q&A, like a get to know me session with my new friends. So if you are interested, please stay tuned and watch. I promise you'd enjoy it. And I'll be asking 11 questions, and then... Um, I will not lie. I did not ask anybody to give me questions. I did not ask anybody. I went online and looked for interesting questions that I know I have answers to. And I prepared it. So, I'm sorry. Yeah. But you're going to like it. If you're interested in... I need all... Best kept secret. Way back way, you know that I don't play. Streets not safe, but I never run away. Even when I'm away, OT, OT, there's never much love when you go OT. I pray to make it back in one piece. I pray, I pray. That's why I need a one day. First question. If I could change one bad habit of mine, it would be overthinking. Like goodness. First of all, this YouTube channel, thinking of doing it, eh? I'm already doing it all. Like I'm already shooting videos and trying to plan and trying to strategize. But I'm already I'm trying to envisage the end from the beginning. I want to know. Can I finish it? Can I start? If I start, will it have head? Will it make sense? Will you like it? Like, there's just so many things I'm thinking about. And I'm like, I need chill. Just take it one step at a time. That part is a big problem for me. I overthink things. One thing I wish people knew about me would be that I'm an introvert. I think I say it too much. It's now, it now seems as though I'm trying to make them believe me. I'm actually introverted. Like, even my husband does not believe me. My husband will be like, I'm you that's a noise maker. You talk, 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 money till night. You are, you are introverted. I'm like, I'm, I'm that talkative because I'm comfortable with you. Like, I'm not like that with everybody. You get me? And then when I'm in a very happy space, when I feel comfortable, you go tired now. I be vibe. My vibe be plenty. But when I'm not happy with you, or when I don't trust you, or when I don't like you, I will be so quiet, so sober. Uh, so, I know that I'm a shy person. I am. And because people have seen the extra side of me, they're not used to the quiet part. So, like, if I'm quiet, so then you feel like, mm, she just be one day one kind. I'm actually a shy person genuinely a shy person and I, and I wish people understand that about me and give me more grace to be myself All that I'm 
solution for my friends Nobody makes it for my ends I had to bust up the silence You know you gotta stick by me Soon as you see the text reply me I don't wanna spend time fighting We got no time and that's why I need a one dance How will I describe my dance? My dance skill? Hmm. Actually, in my head, like in my head, oh, I am phenomenal. Phenomenal. If you know, you know. Like I'm giving you the Basi level, world record standard in my head i'm in this stage i'm on stage and everybody's hyping me up and i'm giving steps you know but then in real life it's just vibes <laughs> vibes and inshallah <laughs> oh, hmm. It's just vibes. It's just, it's just vibes. Let's just leave it like that. <laughs> you see, my fashion sense is come see, come sir. Some days used to enter. Some days, hmm, it's unexplainable. Like, there are days where I just dress up. Like, I dress up. And my husband will be like, Madam, where are you going? Can't change and wear something, honey. I'm like, ah, it's not just here we are going to. What am I going to? I want to dress. Mm. And then on some other days, I dress to kill you. Period. I dress to smash. <laughs> like I dress up, and my husband will be like, ah, madam, I'm just going to do this thing here. I overdressed. My husband will address the my dictionary. Chest to that. In high school, please let me let me chop some meat for that. Mm. 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 In high school, first of all, I was so petite, petite, so small, and I had loud ears voice because my mouth was sharp. Mm. I've always been very expressive, so. Even my small body, you must hear my voice. One. And then, I know book. Forget it. I, I good. Forget it. There's nothing you can tell me. I good right up time. It's just, it's just me thing. Do you get me? I know book. <laughs> Let's put that aside. Thirdly, I was a great dancer. When I was in school, I was such a great dancer at that. Dancing got me a scholarship in SS2, which was, in, which was high school. I met the governor of my state at that time, which was um, Ibinadion, Lucky Ibinadion, because of dance. Like, I danced in front of him and he sprayed me. Ah, that time, I danced so well. But then, Hmm. Every second, knock knock. Who is that? We want to come and carry Anita for rehearsal. Knock knock. Who is that? Anita and me want to go and practice. Knock knock. Wait, ah, my mother said no. This cannot happen. <laughs> this is not why I sent her to come and. And she killed the career of dance. So that's why I didn't flourish in that area. My mom stopped me from attending rehearsals and all of those things. She was like, mm -mm. this thing is not going where I wanted to go, and so it died natural death hmm. we need to refill this glass one minute yeah you guys are that college where it's position this one is not position it's fact for me if money 
enter my hand like this. No. If my hands, by any mistake, scratch or itch me, best believe, best believe, money is touching my hand that day. No. It is not. Mm. It is not the last It is real. And I'm telling you, it works for me. If my man, my hand itches me very well, the money may not be for me, but money will pass through me. Somebody will say, Oh, Annie, help me give this money out. Oh, Annie, for sure, money will touch my hand. I don't think I have like one person that I've been friends with for the longest. I, I think I regard myself as a good friend because I actually have a lot of friends that have lasted for a very long time. So I've had friends primary school. Yes. Yes, I have had friends since primary school. Yes, I still have. I still speak to them. I have friends from secondary school that I still speak to. I have friends from university that we are diehard. So yeah, I think I I I relatively maintain a good relationship with my friends. So to an extent, um, we our relationships have those longevity that longevity generally. Not, not to say that I don't have friends that I that I have cut off with or that have cut me off with of him. I follow up with some of my friends as well because you cannot always you cannot be friends with everybody for the rest of your life. But on a general level, I have friends that have lasted for so long. So I think I'm a good friend, and I think I make good friends too. Am I most thankful for? Hmm. Nice. Mm. I think if I look back, like we always see, look where you're coming from, see where you are now. I have a lot to be grateful for. My life has transformed. unexpectedly and i'm grateful for the people around me who make that possible my family my husband my son i'm just grateful for friends and family around me i think they are an epic part of my entire process and story yeah so yes to you guys mm. but i've been thinking about